Hi, welcome to this brief educational video that will serve as a guide to the Nurse Licensure Compact for nursing students. The objectives of this video are to provide you with a general overview of the Nurse Licensure Compact, to explain obtaining a multi-state license, to explain the NCLEX and applying for licensure by exam, and to provide you with some tangible scenario-based examples. So, what is the Nurse Licensure Compact? The NLC is an interstate agreement that allows nurses, RNs, or LPNs to practice physically, via telehealth, or via other electronic means in all compact states, with one license issued from their primary state of legal residence, their home state. A nurse's PSOR is the state where the nurse has a driver's license and is registered to vote. And legal documents related to residency should all be from that same state. So which states are part of the NLC? You can see from the map that there are 34 blue states. This means that 34 states have enacted the NLC. 33 of those states have fully implemented. New Jersey is purple because it is partially implemented. With partial implementation, nurses who have a multi-state license from another NLC state can now practice in New Jersey via telehealth or physically. Nurses with legal residence in New Jersey will be able to apply for a compact license after full implementation, likely in 2021. To be eligible for a multi-state license, a nurse's PSOR must be a state that is part of the NLC. Also, a nurse must meet all 11 uniform licensure requirements for a multi-state license. These are included in the license application. As a new grad, how does the NLC apply to you? If you are a legal resident of a compact state, you too might be eligible for a multi-state license. You will have to apply for license by exam and authorization to test to the compact state where you will legally reside. Provided you pass the NCLEX and meet all other multi-state licensure requirements, you may be eligible to receive your multi-state license. But what if you are not going to legally reside in a compact state? Unfortunately, until your home state joins the compact, you will not be eligible for a multi-state license. Instead, you can obtain a single state license. Let's take a closer look at applying for licensure pending a job offer. There are many myths associated with taking the NCLEX and applying for licensure. Let's set the record straight about those myths. To clarify, you may not submit application for license by exam to more than one state. The NCLEX is not a state exam. It is a national exam and can be taken in any state convenient to you. You are not required to apply for initial license by exam in the state of your nursing program. So to clarify even more, if you will be residing and working in a compact state, such as Texas, then that compact state is the state where you should apply for license by exam and authorization to test. As stated earlier, you may actually sit for the exam in any state. And your results will be sent to the Board of Nursing where you applied for authorization to test and licensure. In this case, it would be Texas. Now, what about if you will be working in a non-compact state? Well, you will have to apply for license by exam and authorization to test in the state of employment. If after you receive your initial license by exam in a non-compact state and additional licenses are needed, you can obtain those via the license by endorsement application. That application is located on the Board of Nursing website. Now that you have a solid understanding, let's take a look at some scenario-based examples that you can then apply to your own situation to help you gain an even better understanding of steps you should take. In this first scenario, meet Susan. Susan goes to school in California, but she plans to work and live in Arizona after graduation. 
She should apply for license by exam and authorization to test with the Arizona Board of Nursing. She can take the test in California or any other state that's convenient to her, but her results would go to the Arizona Board of Nursing, where she originally applied. In the second scenario, meet John. John goes to school in Arizona, but plans to move to and work in California after graduation. He should apply for license by exam and authorization to test with the California Board of Nursing. Provided he passed NCLEX, he will obtain a single state license, valid in California only. If additional licenses are needed, he can apply for license by endorsement. In this third scenario, this is Mary. Mary is a legal resident of Illinois, but she plans on only practicing in Indiana. Therefore, she should apply for license by exam and authorization to test with the Indiana Board of Nursing. Thank you for watching this short educational video. We hope that you enjoyed the information. We have a variety of other videos and other resources available on our toolkit page, so please go ahead and check those out. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to contact us.